Good evening. Thanks a lot for your presence and for keeping always social distance and wearing a face mask. Those inside your cars can listen to us at 88.3 FM. Please follow Osha's direction to receive communion. Those inside your cars, turn on the light so to let us know if you want to receive Holy Communion. Thank you. The entrance song is God we praise you. God we praise you. God we bless 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 you. God we In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Grace and peace from God our Father and Jesus Christ the Lord be with all of you. Amen. Muy buenas tardes. Buenas tardes. Preparémonos para celebrar dignamente estos sagrados misterios. Recognizing that we are sinners, we ask forgiveness to God for our sins and the sins of the world. You who always forgives us because you love us so much, Lord have mercy. Lord have mercy. You who always listen to our prayers because you love us so much, Christ have mercy. Tú que siempre nos ayudas porque nos quieres mucho, Señor ten piedad. Y que Dios todopoderoso tenga misericordia de nosotros, perdone nuestros pecados y nos lleve a la vida eterna. Let us pray. We offer this Mass for the repose of the souls of Lorraine Moore, Esmeraldo Flores, and Eleno Fernandez. O God, who caused the minds of the faithful to unite in a single purpose, grant your people to love what you command and to desire what you promise that amid the uncertainties of this world, our hearts may be fixed on that place where true God is and ever. A reading from the book of Revelation. The angel spoke to me saying, come here, I will show you the bride, the wife of the lamb, he took me in spirit to a great high mountain and showed me the holy city, Jerusalem, coming down out of heaven from God. It gleamed with the splendor of God. Its radiance was like that of a precious stone, like, a, like jasper, clear as crystal. It had a massive high wall with 12 gates where 12 angels were stationed and on which names were inscribed, the names of the 12 tribes of the children of Israel. There were three gates facing east, three north, three south, and three west. The wall of the city had 12 courses of stones as its foundation, on which were inscribed the 12 names of the 12 apostles of the Lamb. This is the word of the Lord. Thank you, God. Responsorial Psalm. Your friends make known, O oh Lord, the glorious splendor of your kingdom. Let all your works give you thanks, O oh Lord, and let your faithful ones bless you. 
Let them discuss of the glory of your kingdom and speak of your might. Glorious splendor of your kingdom. Your friends make known, O oh Lord, the glorious splendor of your kingdom, making known to men your might and the glorious splendor of your kingdom. Your kingdom is a kingdom for all ages, and your dominion endures through all generations. The Lord is just in all his ways and holy in all his works. The Lord is near to all who call upon him, to all who call upon him in truth. Splendor of your kingdom. Alleluia. 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 Rabbi, you are the Son of God. You are the King of Israel. Alleluia, 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 Alleluia. Que el Señor esté con ustedes. Les anuncio la buena noticia de Jesucristo del Evangelio según San Juan. En aquel tiempo, Felipe se encontró a Natanael y le dijo, hemos encontrado a aquel de quien escribió Moisés en la ley y también los profetas. Es Jesús de Nazaret, el hijo de José. Natanael replicó, ¿acaso puede salir de Nazaret algo bueno? Felipe le contestó, ven y lo verás. Cuando Jesús vio que Natanael se acercaba, dijo, este es un verdadero israelita en el que no hay doblez. Natanael le preguntó, ¿de dónde me conoces? Jesús le respondió, antes de que Felipe te llamara, te vi cuando estabas debajo de la higuera. Respondió Natanael, maestro, tú eres el hijo de Dios, tú eres el rey de Israel. Jesús le contestó, tú crees porque te he dicho que te vi debajo de la higuera. Mayores cosas has de ver. Después añadió, yo les aseguro que verán el cielo abierto y los ángeles de Dios subir y bajar sobre el Hijo del Hombre. Palabra del Señor. Please, have a seat. Today we celebrate the feast of this apostle, Nathaniel who was willing to die for the name of Christ. We knew just a few about Nathaniel, but the things we know is what Jesus is telling us about Nathaniel. He saw Nathaniel and immediately called him to come after him. That's what we know, and I think that's enough. What Jesus can see you, look at you, admire you, and give you the invitation to come and be one of his closest friends and then one of the apostles who will have uh, the church to be uh, sent to the whole world this is what the readings are telling us this evening how the salvation of god is for all nations the first reading is telling us about those 12 doors of the city 12 doors each door was open to every to every side to north and east west and east so every people can enter jerusalem so everyone will be welcome in the new jerusalem salvation coming from god we have to remember it's always salvation as a whole we have to consider this when we meditate or reflect about the salvation we need from god 
Salvation is not something we need uh, particularly, something we need to search just for myself and those I love, those I care. But salvation, we have to be aware of this. We are invited to be saved with the whole world. So I have to be able to include in my way of life every culture, every religion, every faith, every color, every race, every person needs to be seen by me as son and daughter of God. That's what Jesus saw in Nathaniel. Nathaniel himself was from Nazareth and he's asking to Philip, is there something good coming out of Nazareth? So he was speaking about himself. Yes, there is always pure in every region, in every town, in every person, in every culture. There is something good. There is something pure. There is part of the truth in it. So we have to be open to every person and to every culture. And be aware of this. Every person, it's a gift. And every culture, it's a gift. In our community here at San Bernard, Father Daniel was saying yesterday, we have people from, the, uh, from four different continents. I was about to ask, please raise your hand if you are from Australia. Someone here from Australia? You see? One continent is missing here in St. Bernard. We all are here. The faith of Jesus Christ, Jesus Christ fits every desire. It's able to quench every thirst. And my invitation for you this evening is to consider every person, every culture, every language as a gift given from God to us to make this life more colorful, with more uh, colors, with more fragrances, with more savors, with even aware of this, that the salvation is for the whole world. So while the north of the east is burning with the fires, we should be doing something here. So let us pray for them. For those people in the north of our state suffering the fires that are destroying many homes. So we can be in solidarity with them in prayer and also giving some that we have to help these families in distress. <clears throat> Acuérdense de que hoy no voy a predicar en español y nos quedamos hasta después de la misa. Let us present to God our petitions. Le presentamos al Señor nuestras necesidades y las necesidades del mundo. Let us now gather our prayers on behalf of the needs of the world and bring them before our loving God. That the Holy Spirit may nurture in our bishops the missionary zeal of Bartholomew and the other apostles in whose succession they serve. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayers. That the peace of Christ may touch all nations and lead them to tolerance, understanding, and harmony. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayers. That those experiencing grief or emotional anguish may be freed by the Holy Spirit from all their distress. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayers. That members of this faith community in times of doubt and fear may experience the strong and comforting hand of God. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayers. That those who have died may be called by Christ into the splendor of the heavenly Jerusalem. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayers. Let us offer our private intentions. Por todas las víctimas de estos fuegos que están sucediendo al norte de California, roguemos al Señor. Heavenly Father, in your goodness, hear our prayers and answer them according to your holy will. We ask this 
through your Son, Jesus Christ, our Lord. Please be seated. Sigamos orando, hermanos y hermanas, para que este sacrificio que es mío y de todos ustedes sea agradable a Dios Padre Todopoderoso. O Lord, who gave for yourself a people by adoption through the one sacrifice offered once for all. Bestow graciously on us, we pray, the gifts of unity and peace in your church, through Christ our Lord. Amen. And the Lord be with you. Amen. Keep up your hearts. Amen. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. Amen. En verdad es justo y necesario, es deber nuestro y salvador, darte gracias siempre y en todo lugar, Señor Padre Santo. Dios Todopoderoso y Eterno, por Cristo Señor nuestro, porque cimentaste tu iglesia sobre la roca de los apóstoles, para que ella fuera en el mundo signo permanente de tu santidad, y anunciar a todos los hombres tu mensaje de salvación. Por eso ahora y siempre, con toda la multitud de los ángeles, te celebramos llenos de profunda devoción, y te aclamamos cantando, Holy, Holy, Holy Lord. God and host. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. Hosanna in the highest. You are indeed holy, O Lord, and all you have created rightly gives you praise. For to your Son, O Lord Jesus Christ, by the power and working of the Holy Spirit, you give life to all things and make them holy. You never cease to gather a people to yourself, so that from the rising of the sun to its setting, a pure sacrifice may be offered to your name. Therefore, O Lord, we humbly implore you, by the same Spirit, graciously make holy these gifts we have brought to you for consecration, that they may become for us the body and blood of your Son, O Lord Jesus Christ, at whose command we celebrate these mysteries. Porque en la noche en que había de ser entregado, tomó pan de la mesa, te dio gracias, dijo una oración de bendición, lo partió y lo dio a sus discípulos diciendo, Take this, all of you, and eat of it, for this is my body, which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice, giving thanks to you again, he said the blessing, and gave the chalice to his disciples, saying, Tomen, y beban todos de él, porque este es el cáliz de mi sangre, sangre de la alianza nueva y eterna, 
que será derramada por ustedes y por muchos para el perdón de los pecados. Hagan esto en conmemoración mía. And this is the mystery of faith. Save us, Savior of the world. Therefore, O Lord, as we celebrate the memorial of the saving passion of your Son, his wondrous resurrection and ascension into heaven, and as we look forward to his second coming, we offer you in thanksgiving this holy and living sacrifice. Mira, te pedimos en la ofrenda de tu iglesia y reconoce en ella el sacrificio de aquel por cuya muerte quieres reconciliarnos contigo mismo. Grant as we who are nourished by the body and blood of your Son and filled with his Holy Spirit may become one body, one spirit in Christ. May he make of us an eternal offering to you so that we may obtain an inheritance with your elect, especially with the most blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God. Con San José, los apóstoles, con San Bartolomé y todos los santos, a cuya intercesión confiamos siempre. Te pedimos, Señor, que recibas esta ofrenda, esta ofrenda de reconciliación, por la cual queremos que hagas llegar tu paz y la salvación a todo el mundo. Dígnate confirmar en la fe y en la caridad a tu iglesia peregrina en la tierra, con tu servidor el Papa Francisco y nuestro arzobispo José, con todos los obispos, los sacerdotes y todo tu pueblo santo. Listen graciously to the prayers of this family, whom you have summoned before you. In your compassion, O merciful Father, gather to yourself all your children, scattered to all the world, to our departed brothers and sisters, and to all who were pleasing to you at their passing from this life, give kind admittance to your kingdom. There we hope to enjoy forever the fullness of your glory, through Christ our Lord to whom you bestow on the world all that is good. Por Cristo, con él y en él, a ti Dios Padre Omnipotente, en la unidad del Espíritu Santo, todo honor y toda gloria por los siglos de los siglos. At the Savior's command, informed by divine teaching, we dare to say, Our Father, as we forgive those who trespass against us. Líbranos, Señor, de todos los males y concédenos la paz en nuestros días, para que, ayudados por tu misericordia, vivamos siempre libres de pecado y protegidos de toda perturbación, mientras esperamos la gloriosa venida de nuestro Salvador Jesucristo. For the kingdom, the power, and glory are yours. Lord Jesus Christ, who said to your apostles, Peace I leave you. My peace I give you. Look no into our sins, but on the faith of your church, and graciously grant her peace and unity in accordance with your will, who live and reign forever and ever. Que la paz del Señor esté siempre con ustedes. Let us offer each other the sign of peace. Peace be with you. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Grant us peace. Este es Cristo. 
el Cordero de Dios que quita el pecado del mundo. Dichosos los invitados al banquete del Señor. sacramentally come at least spiritually into my heart i embrace you as if you were already there and i unite myself wholly to you never permit me to be separated from you
Let us pray to end. Let us pray for the end of coronavirus. Holy Virgin of Guadalupe, Queen of the Angels and Mother of the Americans, we fly to you today as your beloved children. We ask you to intercede for us with your son, as you did at the wedding in Canaan. Pray for us, loving mother, and gain for our nation and world, and for all our families and loved ones, the protection of your holy angels, that we may be spared the worst of this illness. For those already afflicted, we ask you to obtain the grace of healing and deliverance. Hear the cries of those who are vulnerable and fearful. Wipe away their tears and help them to trust. In this time of trial and testing, teach us all in the church to love one another and to be patient and kind. Help us to bring the peace of Jesus to our land and to our hearts. We come to you with confidence that you are truly our compassionate mother, health of the sick and cause of our joy. Shelter us under the mantle of your protection. Keep us in the embrace of your arms. Help us always to know the love of your Son, Jesus. Amen. Let us pray. Al celebrar la fiesta del apóstol San Bartolomé, hemos recibido la prenda de la salvación eterna. Y te pedimos, Señor, que sea para nosotros auxilio, tanto en la vida presente como en la futura. Por Jesucristo nuestro Señor. Amen. And the Lord be with you. Amen. May the Almighty God bless you all. The Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Go forth and announce the good news of salvation. Amen. Podemos ir en paz, nuestra misa ha terminado. Y están invitados a quedarse en la catequesis. Blessed, 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 blessed